it is different in the maturity levels. I mean, the uh, I mean they're they're younger women, uh, but they seem to be uh, you know more mature than women of that age here in America. Many of the men get married and stay abroad, uh, and that definitely happens. It's not a common occurrence, but it's not exactly rare either. So I, I think, quite frankly, if you could live in her country, wherever that is. I think most of the women would be thrilled. I think they might be interested in coming to America at some point. And usually what happens is you meet the women, you fall in love, you create your courtship and your love relationship. And you know, you can't live there. You've got to work, you've got to do stuff here in most cases. So she kind of has to come here and the women will come here. But if you could live in their country for a while, stay there, stay with them and help them to not have to leave their families and redefine everything, I think a lot of women would be thrilled to have that opportunity, but I don't think they're counting on it. I think most of the women are expecting that they're going to come here. differences are uh, night and day. Of course, uh, you know, I heard uh, these women are just wanting to get to the U.S., uh, somehow take advantage of the man, mm -hmm. and uh, then they're out the door. They got their green card, they got their, their, uh, their, their, their way into the U.S., uh, which is not really the case. Uh, what I've learned now is uh, a lot of the women are sincere. Uh, they're just looking for a new life, a new chapter in their life. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, a start, a start to a, a relationship, uh, a, a long and happy life. Interested? Learn more at... If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Then click on the notice bell to get notified every time we add something new.